All right, I'm getting tired of this mess. And today, in this video, we're gonna do something about it. Stick around. All right, today's garage project, we're gonna build some holders and I wanna put them right in this area here so that are convenient, but off of the counter and all that stuff. And of course, we're gonna use some three inch PVC and we're gonna first cut these down 10 inches and then we'll notch them out. So I'm, I'm sure you've seen other videos, but I don't know if all my subscribers have, so I'm gonna do a video for you. So first we're gonna start by cutting um, these down to 10 inches each. Alright, we get two pieces out of this. I just picked up this at Home Depot. It's three inch PVC by two foot, which will give us four pipes if I need it. So let's get to cutting. And I'm just going to do it with my chop saw. There we go. Take the saw, the miter saw, and cut this one out. There we go, we have two pieces. Cut the other one down as well. go we've got two more all righty so by measuring the, the, the gun right here most of the time two two and a quarter I mean two two and an eighth will work fine for the width of this so what we're gonna do and I guess we're gonna have to make it where it comes back about six inches so I'm gonna measure back here about six inches no wrong thing I got my marker we're gonna measure it back about six inches and then we're going to take this two inch hole saw and we're going to mark the center of it and that's where we're going to drill the hole so i'll show you that okay so like i said what we're going to do is we're going to measure back six inches and then roughly about five inches is where the center of the drill is going to go through so we're going to just put this on here and just slowly put it drill it in And we'll screw that back out. And there's a hole. And we'll do that three more times. Thank <laughs> you. 
And there's the fourth one. We're just gonna clean this up a little bit and then we'll lay out the lines and get that cut. And right, we're just gonna throw a straight edge up here and just kinda eyeball this because it really doesn't matter. As long as this is about two inches to an eighth inches, you're good. So, all right, there's that layout. And let's just get it cut out. All right, we're just gonna use our grinder and cut this out. up a little bit before it's all said and done but let's get the other ones cut out sure does make a mess though <laughs> All right, last one. This makes such a dusty mess, though. So you might want to wear your respirator, I guess. All right, that's the last one. We'll get her cleaned up. And clean some of this dust off of us, too. All right, the last thing I wanna do before I clean this mess up is angle this out a little bit so you'll see it make it easier to get the tool in. I'm just guessing on what I do. I, I might need it to be a little more, but we're just gonna start with this. Got it angled like that, so easier to go in. All right, let me get the other three done, and then we'll move on. up a little bit okay so my plan is to screw them up here so I'm gonna keep them flush out here with my cabinet and I'm gonna run drill two pile holes in there and run two screws from through, right through there so it can hold it hold it up there pretty nice so let me get them laid out and get the screws in them all right I'm just gonna use some inch and a half drywall screws so I don't come busting out the back of my board into my cabinet. Let's get them started here. They look pretty good.
something in there. Pretty good. There we go. All right, we'll get the next one screwed up. All right. All right, we're gonna get these drilled out now as well. On the center. Up right there. easy little project and it's keeps everything organized really nice I, I, I like it like I said this this there is a couple of videos out there doing this already but I don't know if you guys have seen it well, I figured I'd do it I'm doing it anyway so I might as well show you what I'm doing last holes Alrighty, now we just gotta get them screwed up there. Alright, we'll get a couple of screws started in it. Oops. Wasn't started enough. This this screw gun has so much torque when I try to take a small bit out, it slings it across the room every time. So I like it, but it's very torquey. All right, got my screw set in there. We're just gonna mount this one right beside it as level as we can. started. All right. 
That looks pretty nice. All right, there she is. All of them fit from the biggest to the smallest and uh, still have room for another one or multiples across here. But uh, I think that turned out nice. I think maybe the only thing I might do is put a little paint on them and call it a day. So what'd you think of that project? I thought uh, quick, simple, nice storage. I believe I'll probably up this where it stays up a little better so it's out of my face because my vice is right here but uh yeah i think that was a good project i hope you enjoyed it thanks for watching i've got more videos coming that organize the garages a little better um i just trying to get everything in order and keep it nice and tidy so i hope you check back hit that sub button we appreciate it all right thanks a lot we'll see you on the next one